This is an installation video for the Lighting for Impact high intensity wall washer directly onto gondola shelving. To do this, we're gonna use the sliding mounting brackets to mount to the quarter inch holes that are pre-drilled into the gondola shelving. To start, we're gonna to wanna to start with the power first. And that's because to connect these in series, we need to have the power side connected first so that we can continue down the run the full length of the gondola. In this application, we're gonna use an extension cord to get from our power below the base deck up to the top. We go down underneath here and find our power supply. With the extension cord and the wall washer, you'll find that there's a male and female plug on each. We'll find the corresponding plug and plug that into our power supply. There are also threaded fasteners to make sure that these do not come disconnected. Once attached, we're gonna take this extension and feed it around the back of the base deck, like so, and position it so that it can feed its way up to where the wall washer will be mounted. Your kit will be provided with magnetic clips. You can use these to attach to your extension to get it in place. And also underneath the bottom of your shelving towards the front where the wall washer will be mounted. We now have our extension cord fed all the way up to where we're gonna connect to the wall washer. As mentioned, if your power is located up top, you can just go around the back of the shelf here and bring your cord to the front to where the wall washer is going to be mounted. When you look at your wall washer, you'll find that one cord is longer than the other. That is intentional. And you will also find that only the short cord will connect to the power end. So we're gonna go ahead and plug this into power. You can see the lights automatically turn on. And then as before, we're gonna thread tighten this so that these cannot come disconnected. Now that we've verified we have power, we went ahead and unplugged for the rest of this installation. Next, we're gonna start looking at how to mount this onto the bottom of the shelf. We're gonna use these sliding brackets here to position up onto the holes on the shelving. But before we do that, make sure that all of your cords are fed inside the channel provided by the wall washer. Nestle those cords in there as you raise the wall washer up underneath the shelf. Now the pivoting brackets are slid by hand underneath here to a point where a hole on the bracket corresponds with the hole in the shelving. Once that's done, we use the expanding push pins, go through both items and press the head down to expand the pin. That holds the wall washer in place. Now we're gonna slide over and repeat that process on this side, sliding our bracket to a point where it will line up with the hole on the shelving, grab our expanding push pin, push it through both surfaces and then press to expand that pin now that it's expanded, the wall washer is permanently mounted to the shelving. Now that we have the first wall washer mounted, we're ready to install our second. Take the cord that's hanging from the previous light, plug it into the second, and tighten with the threaded connectors. Once that's connected, you're going to feed your cords inside the channel and mount as previously instructed on the first wall washer. Repeat this process all the way down the run if you do find yourself at the end of the run, you can take the cord, since it will no longer be needed, and tuck it inside the channel here, and then mount the wall washer to finish your run. Now that we have all of our wall washers mounted, it's time to plug it in. 